Yes, I want your help. Alright, so this world has two things that Mumbo needs to do. He needs to levitate a huge boulder, and he also needs to levitate Chuffy back, to back onto its train tracks. We'll start with the boulder. Spell in this world is levitation. Since we already activated the conveyor belt and the, and the grinders there, it'll automatically crush the rock for us. If not, we would have had to come back here again as with Banjo and Kazooie. So it spit out the jiggy but in several pieces. There's one. There's the second piece. If we can get it. Yep. And there's the last one. It's actually really rare that Mumble is a is able to get a, a jiggy himself, so that's kinda cool. Now let's go ahead and levitate Chuffy back onto its tracks. Yeehaw! Alright then, back to Banjo and Kazooie. get your help again sometime soon. Alright, next thing we're gonna do is head down this mine shaft. The gloomy caverns. Ah, it's the white ginger! There's only one member of that family, so once we save him, we'll automatically get a Jiggy. But we can't get in there just yet. Alright, 
So here, we're going to split the two characters up. So this is why I decided that it'd be best to learn the just go ahead and learn Split Up in advance so that we could get this Jiggy right away. Welcome to the Power Hut! So Banjo needs to climb up that ladder and step on this light switch. Hitting that switch will turn on all the lights in the basement. Now that little light above the switch means that we can swap to the other character, so we're going to go ahead and do that. So while Banjo's keeping the switch pressed, Kazooie's going to head down into the basement and try to get the Jiggy down there. notice that Kazooie is actually a lot faster than Banjo is, because now she doesn't have b uh, Banjo slowing her down. Let's just take this nice and easy. Because she moves so quick, she's a little hard to, harder to control. Alright, we got it. Let's just get ourselves killed. Because that'll be the quickest way to get out of here. And that got us all of our HP back as well, so that's cool. Alright, next we'll head down here. Warning, unreliable generators. Use at your own risk. So you can power up the generators, but only temporarily. Just fire a fire egg at them. But as Jam George just said, they are unreliable, so we have to be quick. this side. Ah, good, that got us out by the train station. Just where I wanted to go. Let's check out the inside of the train real quick. This is my train control pad. Uh, okay. Her, you'll have to battle me before you go anywhere. Sounds like it came from inside that boiler. Well, let's investigate. King Cole, Grubby Boiler Monarch. Who dares enter Old King Cole's boiler? You 
would, huh? In that case, I'll fight you for it. But you're supposed to be a merry old soul. Purr, not me, pal. But you'll soon be feeling my merry old soul on the top of your puny heads. Now this guy is a boss, but he's actually a joke. If you stand on one of these platforms, he can't get you at all. <laughs> no great loss, I've still got another. It's only a flesh wound. Arr, but I don't need arms to beat you. Perhaps we should sit, and da sit down and talk about this. A little late for that, pal. Ah, oh, there he is. And he's gone. <laughs> okay, perhaps I'll let you use my train after all. But don't you dare hit anything. I've only just polished! So yeah, as long as you stand on one of those platforms, he's an absolute joke. He can't even do anything to you. Alright, so we got another Jiggy, and we now we can now use Chuffy, the, the train. Now you have to open... Uh, in the worlds following this one, you'll start finding train stations in the worlds. Once you open up the train station, then you can bring Chuffy there. So that's kind of neat. Alright then, with that out of the way, I think we should be paying... Ho paying ho we should be paying Humba Wumba a visit next, is what I meant to say. Words are hard. Hey, Wumba. Yep, I'll give it to you. So the transformation this time... ...is a TNT plunger. Wumbo we'll call this detonator. Use control stick to move and press B for self-destruct attack. So yeah, you do have a self-destruct, but every time you use it, you lose one of your... You lose part of your health gauge. So only use it if you have to, really. So you can use the detonator to blow up these TNT barrels. Toxic gas, gas cave. And there's a bird person trapped in that cage. I need you to help me out of this frightful predicament. Who are you? Canary Mary. They used to send me down the mines to check for gas. If I died, they know it wasn't safe. You're telling me. They just left me in here. I don't think I'll last much longer. Or, you know... We can just blow it up. Oops, I wasn't close enough. There we go. Woohoo, I'm free! It's moments like this that make adventuring worthwhile. Walk? Reminds me of the bird sounds you'd hear in the song in Click Clock Wood in the first game. Now, if you've played this game before, then you definitely know who Canary Mary is. And you also know that she loves to race. We'll go get more, more into that later, though. place we need to go. Let's head to the fuel depot. R remember we first went there right when we first got to the world and there was like this box that needed to get through the tunnel? Well, we can help it out now. Okay, 
Okay, that takes care of the rocks. But it can't go any further at the moment because I think it's blocked from the other side. So I think we're going to have to wait to be able to help that thing out fully. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, next we need to be using a warp pad to get to Mumbo's skull. Or near it, at least. Now we can get that Jinjo that we passed earlier. Don't worry, I'm coming. Come on, get in there. Thank you. Bouncing around is not helping. There we go. Yay, the, the single white Jinjo family member has been rescued. Phew, I'm grateful for your help. I thought I'd never find my way home. Take this jiggy for your trouble. It's interesting though, if you had saved one of the other Jinjo families first, they'd call it like the family heirloom or something. Alright, now there's one more thing that the detonator has to do, I believe. to be getting ourselves over to where the crushing shed is. Darn it. That opened up another mine entrance. And I think that's it for the detonator, so let's turn back into Banjo and Kazooie. Let's go visit Canary Mary as Banjo and Kazooie. Because now she's fixed up that minecart that she was nearby. And she's gonna want to race. So I think we should oblige her. Oh, yay, my health is restored. Good. Yeah, why are you still here? My wings are still a bit stiff from spending so long in that cage. How about a race to help me stretch them? <laughs> You're pretty resourceful for an old bird, aren't you? Simply tap A as fast as you can to drive the handcart along. Alright, I think I can do that. 
it's gonna hurt my hand, but I can do it. Here we go. So there's nothing really to this, you just need to hit A as fast as you can. Sorry if you just hear me tapping the A button it's constantly. In fact, I'm gonna mute my mic for this, so hold on. Yay, we beat her. <laughs> that was tiring. Yeah, we won. Well, I guess you can have this shiny thing I found before I got locked in that cage. Is it a jiggy? I can't remember what it is. It's been under my wing for days. Ew, I'm not sure we want it in that case. <laughs> Gross. The wings are starting to feel better. How about racing back again? Hop on the cart if you think you can beat me again. Alright, we will do that. Just give me a minute to recuperate. Alright, so we're gonna race her again. This time the prize is a Cheeto page. And uh, I'll mute I'll mute my mic again just so you don't hear me tapping the E button cons constantly. Yay, did it again. Perhaps you'd like this piece of paper as a prize. It's been wedged in my... No, I don't want to know where it's been. <laughs> I think I've spent quite enough time in this gloomy old mine. I'm off to soup and swore among the clouds. Bye-bye, friends. Perhaps we'll see each other again. Unfortunately. So, um, we will eventually see her again in a world called Cloud Cuckoo Land. And the race there is very notorious because... <sighs> she does this thing that's called rubber banding, where if you, like, get really far ahead of her, she, like, just races straight ahead of you, and then there's, like, no chance of ever beating her like that. It's kind of tricky the way we have to do that race, but I'll get into that later. Anyway, time to enter this place here. It's time for, for another uh, first-person shooter segment. The Ordnance Shooter. The uh, Ordnance Storage, sorry. First, we gotta learn another move from Jam Jars. Beak Bayonet. Another use for the Feathered Freak makes good use of her pointy beak. The bad guys know that it's no joke, just press B to give them a poke! 
Now, I'm not a big fan of the sec segment coming up, but we'll give it a shot. You've learned a beak attack, huh? Well, maybe you can help me out here. A real nasty bunch of TNT sticks have escaped from their box and are threatening to blow up my mind. We'll go in there and blast them? No! Shoot one and the whole mine will explode. You'll have to try and defuse them somehow. Uh, yep, you'll have to be quick, because when you defuse the first one, the others will probably start their detonation timers. Oh boy. Let's give it a try. Alright, so we have 15 sticks of dynamite that we have to defuse. You can't shoot eggs at them at all, you have to use your new move, the beak bayonet. And as soon as you hit that first one, the timer starts. So we gotta be quick. Just keep listening for the telltale bouncing sounds. That's a dead giveaway that there's TNT sticks nearby. I see another one over there. Try not to get too turned around in this place because it's kind of easy to get lost. Okay, we've gone full circle. last two. Yeah. Oh dear. I think I've probably lost this time. Oh yeah, we've lost this for sure. Oh, maybe not. Nope, we're done. They're gonna go boom. We're gonna have to try again. Somehow I managed to do that first try when I first recorded this lo uh, uh, a few years ago. Oh well, let's try it again.